Yes, I was cut off again. But she can't the, the little girl came here to visit me and I seen what she you know, she looked like she was real grown, but she didn't do that around me, you know. But I just talked to them and I said, If you need me to come get her, I will. She won't like it here. Because even though I sit and talk with her, I give her things to do. She needs something to do. She's bored and um she come here, she be busy. I make sure she go get a little part time job in McDonald's or somewhere, um, and stuff like that. Make her do things because it's like these young people today, um, they get bored quick. We was we was coming up, we would learn how to play outside. My mama didn't play that. We didn't stay in the house. And if we was act like we were grown, we had to get out. 16, 17 years old, we had to get out. We had to go. So she wanna be grown, we're gonna teach her like that, teach her to, um, about being grown and wanna catch her before she get pregnant, before she do stupid stuff because She's already into them boys and stuff, fast. I mean, she's really fast. So what we're going to do is we're going to pray for her, and we're going to ask God to touch her little mind that she want to stay in school and that she want to graduate and go to college, do something positive, you know, with her life instead of being out here trying to get pregnant <laughs> and stuff. But um, I'm thinking about just bringing her here and like, just having her to come here and and see uh, what I can do for her because um, I don't mind spending money for young people. I don't mind helping them, but they got to want it for themselves, you know, and stuff like that. But if the mama can't do it, I told them to send, send her here because she needs some, some stability. Um, she needs a strong foundation where somebody, you know, let her know you're not going to act like that. You're not going to do that. I don't believe in whooping, you know, and stuff, beating on children. I believe in putting them in their place. I believe in putting them in time out. Time out for 16 years old, you, you, I can't give you no money. I can't give you nothing, no freedom. You know what I'm saying? No, nothing that uh, is going to allow you to do worse. So my mama didn't play with me. You know what I'm saying? So she was tough on me. And I just praise God that I am where I am today because she didn't play. God didn't allow her to play.